Hi, you guys. Uh, and we're going to have time to do a video on Thursday, so I'm just going to technically do this on Tuesday. So it's TMI Thursdays done on a Tuesday. Yay! I'm sorry for the crappy lighting, and I'm really sorry if this recording doesn't work out before. I tried it twice, and it's just... It, ugh. So I'm going to give you guys 25 questions that you probably don't need to know about me, but now you're going to. And I'm going to try to answer them as best as I possibly can. If I, you guys have any like interesting answers to any of these questions, please, please, please put them in the comment section down below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I would appreciate that. If you're new here and you said you like my face, then give me a subscribe because I freaking love that. I recently hit 11,000 views, and I just thank you guys. I feel the popularity. I, I feel, I'm feeling the love. I'm feeling the love. So what so um I can answer you guys 25 questions before i go to school in 15 minutes so let's get on with this what is your height i am five foot on the dot are you a virgin <laughs> no what is your shoe size i have itty bitty baby feet i have size five feet do you smoke quite avidly do you drink on occasion uh do you take drugs i've done a lot of drugs but i don't do a lot of drugs pretty much just smoke weed now Age you get mistaken for. Believe it or not, people think this lovely face was born in about 1994, not 1996, so I get mistaken for 18. All the time. Do you have any tattoos? I have a tattoo. Do you want any tattoos? Yes, one that I am actually looking at getting this year would be a big shoulder piece of my puppy dog, Hilti, on my shoulder. The Hilti died about a year ago, and I just, ugh, he was my best friend. Okay, do you want any piercings? Well, right now I've got uh, my ears, my eyebrow, and my nose, but I really want my venoms, and that's about it. Um, my best friend. Well, there's three of them. You've got uh, my lovely ex, CJ. You've got my uh, lovely lesbian friend, Jem. And then you've got my leprechaun, Clarice. Uh, Is she a lesbian leprechaun? Yeah, she's technically a lesbian leprechaun. Anyways, my, what is my relationship status? It's complicated. <laughs> what? He's laughing at me. It's complicated. That's what it is. Fuck you. Um, what is my biggest turn on? Um, guys who actually smell like men. That is my biggest turn off. Girls who smell like men. I'd have to say my biggest turn off would be guys who constantly talk about their exes. Oh, that's really getting annoying lately. Um. What is my favorite movie? Easy A. Um, I'll love you if... Um, I will love you if you make me magically not allergic to strawberries and then present me with cho strawberry, like chocolate-covered strawberries, because I I want those so bad lately. Or if you just buy me a chocolate fountain, that would be pretty cool, too. I'll love you if you buy me a chocolate fountain. Someone I currently miss. Right now, I'm actually really missing my cousin Spencer. I want to go hang out with him. My most traumatic experience. As you guys know, I was raped at 14. That would have to be my most traumatic experience. Um, right next to this one time, I got lost in Walmart and I couldn't find my mom. Oh my god, I was so fucking scared. Okay, um, a fact about my personality. I choose to smile all the time. People think I'm just kind of retarded. But no, I'm, I'm actually choosing not to be sad. I have a fuck ton of reasons to be sad, but why focus on those when you can just be happy? Um, what I hate most about myself, um, the fact that I feel really robotic with my emotions, kind of like I'm forcing them half the time, but it's not that I'm forcing myself to not feel things, I'm forcing myself to feel things. I kind of feel emotionless. It's what I hate most about myself. What do you love most about myself? I love that I am extremely accepting and I can look past people's flaws and eventually learn to love them. I'm very good at doing that. What do you want to be when you're older? beautician. Uh, my relationship with my siblings is like, my relationship with my siblings is like really awesome. I have two older brothers and they're both amazing. One currently lives in Penticton and one currently lives in the bedroom behind me. So I love them both. They're amazing. And last question, you guys, my idea of a perfect date. I think I've already answered this. My idea of a perfect date would be looking super, super fine, and then the guy shows up and he's all like, you're so beautiful, and me being all like, I know, and then us just kind of going out for food, casual food, not something super fancy, being able to wear my skinny jeans and my hoodie everywhere, and just generally being in good company, going home and having a big snuggle tickle bite with a movie, and that, that would be, that would definitely be a perfect date for me.
nice and casual. So yeah, you guys, that's TMI Thursdays done on a Tuesday. I hope you guys liked the video. Um, give me a thumbs up and a subscribe, as I said before. I love your guys' faces and whatnot, and you just, you keep pleasing the dolphins, and it's like, it's so good. So good. Thank you. You're saving them. Okay. Um, yeah, bye guys. Have an awesome, awesome, awesome Tuesday slash Wednesday slash Thursday slash whenever the fuck I upload this. Bye!